What's going on guys? I just want to do a quick review on Chime. I'm about a year in so far and about a year and a half or so but besides that <laughs> um, it's a pretty cool banking app like I've tried like Huntington, I use my local credit union and the one big disadvantage with a lot of banks, Huntington is pretty good but a lot of the disadvantages is like everyone's on their phones nowadays so people like the mobile apps and a majority of the banks I've used they're mainly focused on website or like in-person transactions so with Chime it's nothing like that at all it's it's actually a really good app I'll show you right on here it's gonna be kinda hard to see but <laughs> I mean this isn't a good example because iPad kind of it has just a regular no, not the regular, the uh, mobile app on here. But yeah, you have all your options in here. And we're going to go over those in just a bit. But that's one of the big perks of Chime, I feel, is the fact that it's a really good mobile-based platform and also good on the website, too. But I, I, mean, I mainly use it through my phone or tablet, and it's helped out a lot since then. Okay, two. Second perk of Chime would be the fact that you can transfer money to friends automatically. And that's literally just by going to the app. If you have them on Chime, you can click on their name, say, I want to send this much, and then description, and then it's instant like that. And I've used that a lot. I've, I've actually converted a lot of people in my work to Chime just for the fact that, for one, like you can transfer instantly. So if anyone's paying for like food or something like that and you got to send the money, you can just go right in the app and send it that way. On top of that, if your friends sign up for Chime and use your referral code, you both get 50 bucks. So rather than other companies where you only get a referral bonus to yourself, your friend and you get the $50. As long, and the only thing they need is like them to set a direct deposit. And I mean, if you if you set up the direct deposit, that goes on to perk three, which is the fact that you get paid two days early. So yeah, yeah I mean, you literally, I get paid on like, it used to be Wednesday, but it's more focused on like Thursday now. So it's, I mean, it's still a day early, which is nice. Um, yeah, you get paid two days early, it notifies you the second the deposit's put in there, and then on to perk four is the fact that you can actually, if you're trying to save up some money, you can have it to where every time a deposit is put into your account, you can actually have it save 10% of that. So without you even having to like transfer money, it does it automatically for you. So this is the mobile app right here. You're going to start off on your home screen with the spending account and savings account. On top of that, you have your Chime transactions, linked bank accounts, invite friends, that kind of thing. And then if you go to move money, you get a couple more options. For one, you're going to start off with direct deposit. I'm not going to click on that, but basically what that is, is it's a direct deposit form you can send to your work. So rather than having to fill out a, like find one and fill it out with your account information, it's right on there. Um, under that, you're going to have transfer to other banks. That's, good. That's a pretty cool perk right there. So you can take your money in your account and transfer it to banks and also from those banks. So you can literally say, I want to transfer this much to this bank, this one much to that one. And you can have it set up on auto withdrawals as well. So you can have it to where it automatically transfers into another bank. So if you have a savings account set up in another bank, you could do that. Mobile check deposit, that's going to be for, of course, I mean, if you have a check from your work or from, like, just if you received a check from somebody, you can take a picture of that and it'll deposit it within two days. You also have deposit cash, and with that one, you can go to see locations near me. And although it's an online bank account and there's no affiliate banks, like, you can directly go to and deposit cash in, you can still go to... Walmart or a couple of the stores and go to where their money center is and deposit the cash in that way Now underneath that we have transfer funds. This is basically if you click on that You can go and transfer funds to other people. So I'm not gonna click on that because I got a couple friends on there Yeah, you can go transfer funds and you can send money to your friends instantly I've actually got that set up for a couple of my a couple of my coworkers at work where if one goes to get lunch and I need to like I need to send them some money for that. I can just do it right through the app and direct deposits directly in their Chime account. Now, oh, actually, you know what? Now, under that is going to be transfer funds, and that's basically between your savings account and your checking account. And you can transfer some funds from checking savings but then the cool thing is if you're trying to save up some money but you keep on like taking money out of your savings this only has 
five transfers per month from savings to checking. So if you go over those transfers, it locks you out from doing so. Now under that is pay friends. And what that is, is basically, I mean, kind of self-explanatory. You can pay your friends right through the app. And I set this up with a couple, a couple of coworkers where if they go and get lunch and I owe them money, I can send it right through the app. So that's pretty convenient. And of course, mail a check. You can actually mail checks connected to either your savings or your checking to, I mean, a person. You can do it for uh, if you're like, a, you pay your rent through check, if you pay your bills through check, that kind of thing. It's pretty convenient. That way you don't have to have a checkbook on hand all the time to use that. Uh, there's another thing called pay bills electronically. You can log into your accounts or pay just your bills through your account number through the app. So these are some of the move money features, which is pretty convenient. Another cool thing is ATM map. If we click on this, then you can actually locate all the ATMs in the area that you can use for either cash back or you can use it for just ATMs so you can withdraw money. So that's a pretty convenient feature. But yeah, that, that concludes the mobile side of this. Okay, so although Chime does have its advantages, it does have some disadvantages as well. For one, depositing cash into it, you have to go all the way to Walmart. That's one of them. Second one would be the fact that there's no overdrafts, so you can't like like overdraft your account if you like need a little bit of extra money on there. Third one would be the banks. There's it's an online bank, so you can't really go to a like a local place or something like that to if you have questions or anything like that, but there is a chat through the app. That's all I can really think of right now. I mean, there's not many other disadvantages besides that. I mean, there's there's some, but I couldn't think of any off the top of my head. Um, but yeah, I, I really like Chime. I, and for the fact that you can get like instant deposits, all that kind of stuff, that, that's really helped out a lot. But guys, that should be it. I mean, that's just a basic video. I just did make, tried to make it quick for you guys. Uh, I, I like Chime myself. I've been using it for, like I said, about a year. And yeah, if you want to get signed up, there's actually a link in the description. And if you do click that and then refer through that, the first deposit you make in there is going to actually get you $50 from doing so. So if you want to get that signed up, you know, like I said, it's just in the description. So y'all have a good one. See ya. Also, if you saw in the video that kitten jumping at me, that's this one right here. This is Lily. She's one of our new kittens. Other one's Wendy, but I couldn't find her. She likes attack in the hand. <laughs> but, yep, that's it. See you guys.